it's Renee Olivia and in this video I'm going to be showing you some fun flirty little beach dresses beach outfits that you can wear if you're going on vacation soon and some of these are going to be even great for like if you're going to a beach wedding um, any fun event that's coming up and like listen spring is going to be here before you know it and maybe you're in a spring um, location anyway with warm weather but I love all of these dresses and I can't wait to share them with you. But first, if you're not a subscriber, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the bell. That way you never miss any of my videos. And if you're not familiar with my channel, I am basically, I'm 50 years old and I am trying to convey the message of growing old gracefully and throwing in some fashion tips and tricks here and there. Um, also beauty. Um, and I'm going to be showing you some like working out routines and what I eat as well. So anyway, I hope you join along. I would love to see you here every week. Okay. So this is the first dress. I feel so like feminine and flirty in this dress. I love it. I love the little slit. It gives it like a nice sexy look, but it's also like a classy, sexy look. Um, I don't like to be overtly <laughs> sexy when I dress. I really do try not to. This top is like getting there. It's like nice little V, shows off a little cleavage, but because of the length of the skirt and that it's like so flowy, I feel like it just counterbalances the sexiness on top. So I like the little balance that it has and I just love it. And I paired it with these adorable, I don't know if you've seen these shoes, but they are not the Bowman, I believe the I believe it's Bowman who makes these and they're so expensive but I've been obsessed with them but I found these dupes I'm gonna link them below because I'm obsessed like they're not four inches I can't wear four inch heels they're like 3.75 and they're perfect and they're super comfy and so cute and it goes perfect with this dress and then I just paired it with a little bucket bag because I love these straw bags for spring summer looks so this I'm going to tell, I can't remember. I think this is an extra small. I will link the sizes and the prices on the screen and then down below as well. And if you didn't see, I did post a video on Amazon dresses, all under $50. So check those, check that video out as well. I'll put that above to, um, cause there's a lot of options in that video as well, but I really love this. I love the print color super flattering and if you see up close it's just like a really pretty floral i love it i love it love it love it love it so let me show you the next one how fabulous is this dress like amazing uh i love the slit i feel like a little like angelina jolie because you have to actually make sure your leg is out to see the slit but i love how it just flows the material is so soft I love it love the print I love the deep V because of how long and flowy it is you definitely need that kind of top with this with the spaghetti strap love it I mean and then I just changed it up because um, this is much more of like a fancier dress than the, the first one first one was more like a day dress this is more like a night dress um, I feel like I'm going to Saint Tropez like it's just so luxurious but so pretty I, I, I'm, I'm so in love with it my only issue is that when I saw it online it was a brighter green so this is so you can see this is a, a definitely darker green and I'm 5'3 and it's a little long I have the same heels if you can see I have the same heels I had on before but again I'm 5'3 so it's just a tad too long so we'll have to get it hemmed. But if you're like five, four and above, I think this would, this length would be perfect with you with like three and a half to 375, 3.75 inch heels. Um, and then I just put like a really like classy glam bag with it. And there you go. And I changed up the earrings. I think gold looks really pretty with this green. I'm wearing an extra small, I believe. Again, I'll put everything down below. If you have any questions though, let me know. I think it's such a gorgeous and so affordable. Oh, I love it. Okay, now I love this flirty, fun, cute dress. It's it kind of looks like a romper, but it's not. It's actually a wrap dress. Um, 
I love it. Now, normally, because it has the deep V and it's shorter, I normally don't wear something like that. And not because of my age, I just personally don't like to. But because this is perfect for a warm weather vacation or somewhere super fun and whatever, not that, anyway, I feel like it's perfectly appropriate. Now I'm wearing heels with this. Normally I'll wear um, flats or something comfortable, but I really do think that this is really cute with the heels. Um, and then you can wear your little, add your little straw bag. And how cute is this little outfit? And yes, I'm 50 years old and I wear this. It's a $13 dress. Like you cannot go wrong. I'm obsessed with it. <laughs> like literally obsessed. So every vacation I bring this because there's always somewhere you can wear this. Somewhere if you're eating lunch or going to dinner, you can dress it up, dress it down. Going to the beach, you can wear this over your bathing suit. Like there's so many options for this dress. And for $13, hello. It comes in lots of different, I think, patterns. I don't know, lots, but I know there comes in different patterns. Um, and I'm wearing an extra small, I believe, but I'll list everything below. And I did check recently and it's still available, so. How cute, I love it. Okay, so this next one is so pretty. Um, now, I bought this a little while ago. I'm gonna double check and see if it's still available, but I know I've seen this come back again. So even if it's sold out now, I think they're gonna bring it back because it was super popular. Um, but I I really didn't know how I was gonna feel about it. But when you put it on, you just feel so feminine, so pretty. And this is again, great for really anything. You can dress this up or dress this down. Um, again, I've got the same heels on because I just wanna keep everything neutral, but it's just a really pretty feminine romantic dress. I actually feel like, I don't know if you watch Sex in the City, but uh, when Carrie Bradshaw had that beautiful like floral dress on and then she fell in the pond in uh, Central Park with Big, I don't know if you watch it, but that's how I feel. Like, I just feel like it's so like, I was obsessed with that dress. But anyway, um, so it's very affordable, very um, classy and pretty and perfect for any occasion, um, especially in the spring and summer. So that's why I wanted to show you. I'm crossing my fingers, it's still available though. I believe it came in black too. So again, I will list everything down below. And if I can't find it, the specific dress, then I will um, find something similar. Also, if you're not into prints, don't worry. I've got all solids color colors coming up right now and a couple bodycon dresses as well if you're not into the fun, flowy kind. But I've got it covered, so let's get to the next one. Okay, so this is the next dress. Now, again, this is very low cut and it's short. So what I usually wear this with is it's a cover up for a bathing suit. So just keep that as an option. It's very affordable, um, but it's also super cute. So if you're comfortable with the low um, V and the shortness of the dress, then go for it. I think it's an adorable dress. I just personally um, feel like it might be just a little bit too low cut for me. And it's not because of my age. It's just, I just don't feel comfortable with it. Um, but, um, again, I wear it as a cover up, cover up and it's super affordable. So I think it's still available. I will link it. Um, but the other thing you can do is you can wear like a cute lace camisole under this as well. And it would look amazing. And I actually have some cute options from Amazon. I, I can link them below, but also I wanted to show you this when you pair it, I like to pair it with the, uh, this dress with the straw bag but also use like a, a silk scarf to brighten it up with some color, um, just to kind of break up the whiteness. But um, I think it's super cute, I love it. And it's so affordable. So, you know, you can't, you can't lose with this dress. So this next dress is bodycon, solid color, in case you're into that. Now, here's the thing, as much as I love this, and I have a lot of these types of dresses, my, Couple issues, it's, it's a little see-through, the material. It's not very flattering around my tummy, not liking that. Um, so this is gonna go back, but this is also, also can be a great cover-up for a bathing suit. I feel like it's very lightweight material and it's got the two slits, sorry. 
Um, so cute, um, but for me personally, I don't feel comfortable in the dress, so I would be very self-conscious. So my thinking is if you don't feel comfortable in it, don't get it and don't stress about it. There's many other dresses that will make you feel comfortable and make you look really amazing. So this is just not one of them for me personally. So the last one's coming up. Let's see if uh, you like this one. Hold on. Okay, so this is the last dress that I wanna show you. And this is very similar to the previous um, dress that I showed you, but there's thing, two things that are different and why I love this one and not the other one. One is this is not see-through so important <laughs> and secondly i think because of the placement of the slit here it's just so much more flattering and i feel like it hides my tummy way better if you look at the difference my hips looked huge in that fast dress and my tummy looked really big you know and we want to hide these kind of things as women and so i feel like this dress really helps suck in my waist a little bit more has a nice flattering um, slit and I love the color. The color is really pretty. So that's why I love this one. And this is an Amazon dress, super affordable. I'm going to link this. I can't remember the size I'm wearing because I got it a while ago, but I'll link everything below. And I want to know what your thoughts are. Okay. So that was my video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and comment down below on which one was your favorite or if you absolutely hated them all. <laughs> I want to hear. But if you're not a subscriber, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the bell. That way you never miss any of my videos. And I hope to see you all next week.